Hello and welcome to this week's Crane Report. I'm Brett Day. Thanks for joining me. On Wednesday, August 23rd, NSWC Crane was honored to host Congressman Trey Hollingsworth of Indiana's 9th Congressional District. The Congressman had the opportunity to tour Crane's unique facilities, talk with technical experts, and meet with our executive leaders. We also had the privilege of hosting Congressman Jim Banks of Indiana's 3rd Congressional District on Friday, August 25th. The Congressman toured CAAA in the morning with afternoon detailed briefs and tours of NSWC Crane's technical labs. On Thursday, August 24th, Crane, along with regional partners, participated in the third federal networking event at the University of Southern Indiana. This was the largest turnout to date and offered a great forum for informational briefs and collaborative discussion. Attendees included community leaders, entrepreneurs, and various industry companies. Ms. Brooke Pine, NSWC Crane's Technology Transfer Program Manager, has more. What this event does is actually put external individuals in contact with the direct individual within the lab that would be responsible for helping them build a relationship within their area of interest. So whether it will be acquisition driven, technology transfer driven, or again HR driven where they might want to be an employee, they can get one-on-one -on -one advice, dialogue with those individuals from the lab. Thanks Brooke. On the horizon, we're looking forward to dedicating the EA-6B Prowler aircraft on September 14th. This aircraft symbolizes Crane's electronic warfare routes dating back to 1971. More details to come. In closing, be sure to like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter and Instagram at NAVC Crane. And subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also, don't forget to join in our like, share, and retweet campaign to see how we're expanding the advantage. On behalf of NSWC Crane Division, I'm Brett Day. Thanks for watching the Crane Report.